somebody can explain those things to you and they can help you to understand what it's like, but you will never truly grasp the feeling of real joy and happiness unless you know what it feels like to be on the other side. Welcome to Jay's Way. Please hit like, subscribe, and comment below. Stop expecting a relationship with no issues. Stop it. Stop pretending that everything is supposed to be perfect and wonderful all the time. It's not. Life is not a bunch of butterflies and roses and that's just not the way things actually work if you're happy there will be times that feel that way but being happy does not mean that it stays that way all the time it means that you know how to feel that way even when things aren't like that it means that you know how to go from a, a negative place and bring yourself back to that positive feeling in a timely fashion and to experience the joy that comes from knowing not only that you're in a good place but you're not but also that you're not in that bad place anymore in your marriage and in your life you cannot know what true joy and happiness is and how those things feel unless you have felt and experienced unhappiness and problems and negativity somebody can explain those things to you and they can help you to understand what it's like but you will never truly grasp the feeling of real joy and happiness unless you know what it feels like to be on the other side in a marriage arguments take place differences of opinions take place and when those things happen it can cause bitterness it can cause discontent it can ta cause a lot of negative things to take place but it's not about having an argument it's about healing from that argument and learning from the experience okay you really shouldn't have the same fight over and over and over again. It may happen a few times. Not all people in the relationship are going to understand everything that they need to understand immediately. It might take some time for them to figure things out. But the good person is not the perfect person. It's the person striving to learn those lessons through the adversity that comes in your marriage. So a good husband, a good wife is not somebody that never makes a mistake, never argues with you, always does what they're told and just bows to you in every way. That's not a good relationship. A good relationship is when you have those negative situations and you can come back together and heal from them in a way that brings you back to that place of peace, love, and joy that's what we all want and that's how we get there by working hard and putting in the effort to get there together that's what the Savior wants for us and that is Jay's way <laughs>